I mean, obviously, many South Korean fans will notice your voice, but yes. they never saw you. No. Yeah. So, can you briefly introduce yourself? Okay. Yeah. yeah. My name is George Sefton. Yeah. Uh, my title here is the stadium announcer. I've yeah. been doing the job since the 14th of August, 1971. 71, yeah. Uh, which, by coincidence, is the same day that Kevin Keegan made his debut. Ah, right. Uh, but uh, I'm still here and yeah. he isn't. Yeah. <laughs> which is right. good. Can you describe how was Liverpool at that time when you started working? When I started working yeah. here, um, Liverpool um, was in a new era because yeah. when I first started coming as a fan, we were in the old second division. We'd been down there nearly all my life. And then Bill Shankly came along. Um, he, want, he wanted to change everything. Mm. He was had unlimited uh, ambitions for the club. Yeah. Um, everybody thought he was crazy, but he was determined, he was focused. He, he knew exactly what he needed doing and how to do it, and mm. he set about doing it. Mm. So I started coming in 1960, January 1960. Um, two years later, we won the championship of the second division. Mm and came up to uh, the, the old first division yeah. and this was a whole new world for my generation. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Can you tell me that, I mean, including the Steven Gerrard's goal against mm. Olympiacos, Liverpool FC has so many great forwards, great mm. uh, legends, and can you tell me some of the greatest goals you ever seen in Anfield? Uh, <laughs> that, there's been a few. Yeah. I mean, Things to stick in my mind mm -hmm. are strange ones like you know Phil Thompson yeah. when he was a lad when he just started playing mm. he scored a fantastic goal I think it was against Derby County uh -huh. and over the years I mean Dan Lovren against uh, was it Borussia Dortmund last year year before last last year mm. now, nowadays we we, appear, we score a lot of team goals. Mm -hmm. but, and last year, obviously, mm. they had a new thing. We had Mohamed Salah, mm -hmm. who scored some brilliant mm. individual goals. Mm -hmm. But um, there seems to be a lack of long-range shooting mm. nowadays. But when when they do, you know, they they stick out. But you know, as, I, as I say, the, um, that one of Stephen Gerrard yeah. sticks out because it was a fantastic goal. Yeah. Um, Especially but, from the long yeah, range, right? And you know, well, away from Anfield, obviously, Stephen Gerrard against West Ham in 2006. Yeah. Javier uh, Alonso, mm. you know, from scoring from his own half mm. uh, against was it that Luton Town? Mm. It's a long time mm. ago. And he he worked his way through the, but mm. they um, again sometimes it's uh, the goal itself is fantastic, and mm. sometimes it's mm. a situation. Mm when you know, it's not a particularly good goal, mm. like Luis Garcia against mm. Chelsea, mm. it's because it meant so much at the yeah. time. Yeah. You think, oh, I'm glad I was here when that happened. Yeah. So it's, but Stephen Gerrard mm. is a very quiet man. Mm. You know, I wonder sometimes you know, about whether he's too quiet to be a, a great manager, mm. but I think he's, he's uh, I think he'll prove us all wrong. You know, I'm, I'm looking forward to the day when he's won uh, the Scottish League for Rangers and, and, and Jürgen, then, yeah, when Jürgen retires yeah. I'm sure Stephen will be back here. Yes, yeah, so I'll, uh, I'll, I very much doubt it but I'll, uh, <laughs> I'll, I'd like to be around. Yeah. Hi, this is George Sefton from Anfield and I'd just like to say a big hello to all our Liverpool fans in Korea. I hope that one day you'll all get to come to Anfield, experience the atmosphere, live the dream it's the greatest place on earth and you don't know what you're missing till you've been. We look forward to seeing each and every one of you here at Anfield in the not too distant future. In the meantime, you'll never walk alone. Thank you very much.